Hi everyone. So we were working on our meet our team section. So now let's define the hover effect and one more thing that my image corners are pretty sharp and we can have a little bit of radius on that. So that is team card IMG and border radius is going to be 3 pixel and this is, is it there? Really? Team card IMG, let me say 30 pixel. No. What is going on? Okay, sorry, 3 pixel and this is not border, border radius. Okay, so now yeah, it is there. Okay, so now I need to define the hover effect. So now for the hover effect, how it will work. So uh, my this div, which is having the image, I'm gonna have one child div of that, which will be placed with the absolute positioning right at the bottom. And it will not be visible because for this particular div, I'm gonna say overflowing content is hidden. That means that anything outside this div will not be visible. And once I hover over that, I'm gonna move it upwards, yeah. And that's how, that's the idea behind that, how I can have this very nice, hover animation you know on the top of this uh, dev element yeah so let's do that so this is my dev this is my team card image dev within that one this is image and as a child of this element so this needs to be the child of it so where i can control the absolute positioning of that yeah so i'm gonna say this is team card image let's call it inner not like that team card image inner okay so this is fine right now for my team card image inner and where is my team card here is my team card yeah so the position of team card image inner that will be absolute so that means that i need to define the position for my parent element and that's what team card image so let's do that position is going to be relative and now i can say that team card oops i'm doing it at the wrong place sorry so that is where did i define that earlier no i haven't Okay, let's do it in the last time. So team card image and I would say position relative. Now team card image inner position is going to be absolute. Width is going to be 100%. Height is going to be 100%. Background color. Let's have color for the moment. Actually, we should be having background image because we're gonna. Uh, we, we can have the color also. Yeah, we just need. We don't need the, the gradient. Though we can we can use gradient, but I'm gonna use only a simple color with a bit of a transparency. So let's see that up till this point, what happens? Okay, I can't see my this one. Width is equals to not 100, 100 percent, and 100 percent. And here is my second dev yeah and the position is actually absolutely fine at the moment yeah the only thing is i don't want it to be displayed i want to display it like you know once uh, i hover over and let me show you that how we're gonna do it and just to be like you know on the just to be on the safer side we can define its position as well that top is going to be 100 percent though it is already uh, at the moment 100 percent so no change and left is going to be zero and still it's gonna stay the same yeah okay so now uh, what we what would happen that when we will be hovering over so there we would say that top is equals to zero and the moment I do that so this top zero is exactly coming on the top of the image and here I can give a little bit of transparency just to first see that how it is looking I can do a little bit more and then we would define the positioning later and uh, yeah I'm okay with this right so now the first thing 
top is going to be 100 percent okay so this is coming down but i don't want to I don't want it to be displayed while i'm not hovering over yeah so for that simply what i need to do on the team card image if i say content uh, no, overflow hidden so yeah my that element is still here but because i'm overflowing content i've said should be hidden so now that is not visible anymore now what i can do i can say team card image hover and the moment i do that so now here is the thing so when i uh, when i'm hovering over on my team card image then i want to select what element team card image inner and for that i would say top is equals to zero left is equals to zero and here it is yeah again what i'm doing i'm saying when i'm hovering over team card image and then i'm selecting you know its child element dot team card image inner so the hovering will be taken care from here and the effect will be applied to this one and what effect i'm saying make it stop to zero before its stop was 100 percent but on the hover make it zero and let the left be zero only and now it's all like you know just coming in a fraction of second now just to animate it what we can do on the parent element which is this one i can say our old friends transition all and 0.3 second let's see what happens and here it is brilliant yeah that's exactly what we wanted now what we need to do we need to add some social media icons and that we will do in the next video yeah thank you so much